Michaela is strong-willed, confident, and passionate. I got to be her teammate for two years, and I just feel like these three words really describe who she is as a person, and it's really fun getting to play with someone who is really passionate about the game. Michaela is a light in my life. She is the sunshine on my rainy days. She makes me smile. She brings up the mood all the time. Michaela is one of my favorite teammates I've ever played with. Aside being one of my good friends, she's a baller, she's tough, she's funny, which makes the whole environment super loose and chill. Very competitive. You always wanna be on her team because you're probably gonna win. Willing to do whatever it takes to be her best. My name is Michaela, I'm 22 years old. I'm from Oak Park and I'm a former collegiate basketball player and I aspire to play overseas next year. As Thornton, free throw line extended left side. Makes the extra pass, now it's Thornton inside. Tough shot, right hand is good. COVID has had a really big impact in my uh, journey to go play overseas because originally I was supposed to go this year in August. Because of the pandemic, I had to push back the application process to 2021 and hopefully by that time, I will be able to actually go over there and play. Transitioning from high school to college basketball, I would have to say the speed is like, it's a lot faster and girls run a lot faster, they make more shots, but it was an environment I got used to fast and fell in love with. I doubt myself a lot actually. I think I'm my own biggest critic, but to combat that, I just try to get in the gym and try to get better at those weaknesses. My favorite move is a Euro step. Um, I feel like it's the best move. I drive a lot and it creates space uh, between a taller defender and myself so I can score. So a quick step inside and finish on the outside with a right-handed layup. I prefer defense because I feel like you really have to work and anticipate to get steals, to get blocks. And it's just more, I feel like it's more rewarding as a player to get like a stop on defense and then have it transition into offense. I would have to say right now, my favorite player would have to be Diamond DeShields. She's on the Chicago Sky. Here's a first look at DeShield. She scoops it in with the left hand and an impressive early look from the rookie. And quickly ahead. Allie's going to run. Nice oh, pass by right. DeShields and the finish for Courtney Vandersloot. Pitches it off. Yeah, good job of advancing the ball by Quigley. Before COVID happened, I would go to a lot of those games. She's just a really shifty player and she's just, she has this presence on the court 
that no one can deny. She's gonna score either way it goes, and I just love that about her. As she has speed, quickness, and she's shifty with the ball. Now the Shields, oh, behind the back to Parker. It's Diamond to Shields with it is. Come on, Diamond. Has been electric. And look at this look. Up to Cheyenne Parker. In the game of basketball, it's important to know how to shoot, but it's even more important to know how to handle the ball. If you practice ball handling, you're gonna get more confident. A piece of advice I would give those girls who are watching right now is to never give up. I didn't want to play my senior year of high school because I barely played, but I stayed dedicated to the game and it all worked out in the end. Hi, my name is Michaela. I looked away. Um, let me start over. <laughs> but before we do that, I do have to pee. Or no, I can hold it. <laughs> 